But what is more bizarre than running around half naked? I listen to Marilyn Hickey, TBN televangelist, and I quote, what do you need? Start creating it. Start speaking about it. Start speaking it into being. Speak to your billfold. Say, you big, thick billfold full of money. Speak to your checkbook. Say, you checkbook you. I told you this is beyond going naked. You've never been so prosperous since I owned you. You're just jam full of money, aren't you? Well, that's not all that was jam full of something. Kenneth Copeland, you talk about bizarre. You don't have a God in you. You are one. And don't be disturbed when people accuse you of thinking you're God. Pray to yourself. That is beyond running around naked. You have the same creative faith and ability on the inside of you that God used when He created the heavens and the earth. Yeah, just create your own little universe for you to live in. Your own little fantasy world. Kenneth Copeland said, God is a being that stands somewhere around six foot two inches tall. There's a high view of God for you. He said, I don't preach doctrine. Well, we believe you on that. I mean, we're walking forward on that one. I don't preach doctrine, I preach faith. Yeah, faith in yourself and faith in the devil. Fred Price in this town says, have a Rolls Royce faith. And Benny Hinn says, are you ready for some real revelation knowledge? You are God. He said, Christians are little messiahs. Christians are like gods. He said, never, ever, ever go to the Lord and say, if it be thy will. He said, we Christians possess power in our mouths to heal or kill just as witches possess it. And he said, we are little messiahs, everything that Jesus ever was. This inner light, this supposed inner intuitive subjective message from the Holy Spirit in you, not coming through the written Word of God, Owen says, would divert attention from the perfection of the Bible. It's just going to draw you away into a fantasy world. It's going to, to pull you away from where you need to be setting your anchor in the written Word of God. It is going to bring you over here into that which is useless and false.